we were happy to get Wizard of Oz. Everybody knows it. Everybody loves it. Um, it's a challenge, though, because the script is actually a screenplay. Um, they sell it as, as a stage play, but it's written um, as, as a screenplay. So um, it really challenged our stage actors, our crews, but um, they're magnificent people, and we did it. So <laughs> Good. Now, in addition to yourself, uh, Mary Ellen, we have a couple of, uh, couple of participants, a couple of uh, actors. We have uh, Savannah Gallagher and Charlie... Forte. Charlie, you are, uh, what is your role? I am the Emerald City Guard and one of the farm hands at the beginning and the end of the show. Okay. And Savannah, you are, what's, what's your role again now? Oh, I just play this little girl named Dorothy. <laughs> <laughs> uh, for, I, I have to ask before I ask for the question, what's, what's it like playing oh, Dorothy? It is a dream come true. Um, I've loved The Wizard of Oz since I was little. Um, the first time I watched it, I was terrified of it. <laughs> but I've grown to love it more than I could possibly think I could. Um, my cast is great. My director is great. But becoming, becoming Dorothy has been one of the greatest opportunities I could have ever received in my entire life. Good. And I'm so grateful. If I may ask you a question, let's not sell you short here. You are also our scarecrow in our production. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, my wife says I'm perfect for it because I have no brains. <laughs> uh, <laughs> but uh, yes, I am. Uh, I am involved in, in the Wizard of Oz. I am uh, Ray Bolger Jr. I guess. Yeah. Yeah. You're, You're wonderful. It is. It, it, you it, great it's job. a lot of fun. It's a lot of work, but it's. Uh, but it's. It, it's a lot of fun. I'm, I'm having a ball. And. One of these days, I'll remember all my lines. <laughs> Wait till you hear him sing in The Wizard of Oz. A unbelievable, really phenomenal voices, both of them. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Is, uh, is there any particular technique right that away, you use? Right away, repetition is everything. Just getting it down, repeating it over and over. I just <laughs> run the entire scene in my head trying to get my cues, get everything in place, on point, ready for opening night. So I've never really had to memorize lines before this production at such a huge amount. But I actually credit our Tin Man with a lot of my strategies as a how I memorize lines. At the beginning of rehearsals, Bob Bender, he showed me this app that I can type all of my lines in. It's called Cold Read, and it basically feeds you all your lines like a teleprompter. And I can just be cleaning my room, doing laundry, making dinner, and I can put this up and just write my lines as I'm doing these everyday tasks. And I use it every day, and it's perfect. What advice would you give someone who would want to be the next Savannah Gallagher or want to be the next Charlie Forte? Sees your performance and says, "You know what? I, I would, I would like to do that. I would like to follow that path." W what advice would you give them? Um, I would say to use theater as an outlet to come out of your shell, and one of the best ways you can do that is through making friends with your castmates. Um, I'm lucky enough to have made some of the best friendships I could ever wish for through these productions over the last few years. Um, I've known Ed since I was very young, um, and I've just met Charlie, but we are becoming fast friends. Um, but th those kind of relationships are ones that are going to last you for a really long time. Yes. And the tighter cast you are, I feel the better show it produces it produces and you can and the audience can really tell that you guys are tight-knit if you guys are friends off stage as well going off that there's right away do it yes there's there is no judgment there's no role to either big or too small everyone pitches in we're all friends mm -hmm. one of my unexpected friends is <laughs> is actually our toto Yes. <laughs> she's, she's what? Eight, she's she's a, eight, nine? She's a yeah. ball of energy. I love her. Can do a full split better than anyone I have ever seen, <laughs> and she'll do it in the show, and you better see it. Yes. <laughs> no, but in all seriousness, seriously, do it. It will bring you out of your shell, like Savannah was saying. When I started doing it way back when, I 
I'm going to get serious here. I was not happy with myself, and it helped me find what I like to be and what I want to do. Yeah. Good for you.